hello everyone welcome to the cloud network in this tutorial i will show you how to install os x man rigs with nourish on your virtual box so to install virtual box uh, in this uh, man rigs ox as you need to have a minimum requirement you need to have this 64 bit is supported uh, it's also support with the uh, intel or amd so it supports this uh, intel i3 i5 i7 or xeon xenon processor or dual core processor support you need to require 2 gb ram at least and you need to have it at least 7 gb of free space in a hard day hard drive hard disk that is or at least you can have more to the to, to the 7 gb and a graphic card or display card you need to have one one uh, one zero two four into seven and six so <coughs> you can make a full screen with the help of this option so here is our download is there virtual box mm, virtual box uh, we need to download first of all virtual box then we need to download virtual box extension then we need to download the is image of nourish so i will show you these three after that computer with amd processor will not work with alloy and also there is a note of this uh, destroy will be download as say iso file or dmg file which are dvd image so be sure not to download as a vm vm where image of loin as those version do not work with virtual box so now i will show you where you can download so you can see this is my nourish 10.0.8 installer those this one is my os x mandrix iso image which i have downloaded from the torrent and the size is 5.707 gb is the download size uh, so open your uh, search engine you need to type virtual box on google uh, this is the website you can see on, on your screen virtual box just click on this link and for this uh, extension box uh, just click on this you will become on this website uh, maybe something is having problem with this virtual box uh, just now, maybe now so later you try it will be work on so you need to search for this download you will get here only uh, the download after that you need to download virtual box and you need to install it you can find how to install uh, virtual box in my cloud network channel so here is a extension box where you can download virtual box this is the link uh, you can download and this one is a torrent where you can download uh, nourish iso 10x 10.8.0 the size is 4.17 gb so here is the you need to download so you can see which i have downloaded the nourish 10 point inshallah iso image 4.16 gb is the size and uh, this is a torrent link where you can download so all these links you will be having available uh, below to my video descriptions you can uh, add these links so this is my virtual box just click on new uh, we need to type os os space x man rigs in so after typing Mandrix, uh, you need to select your uh, macOS type. You need to select this one. After that, you need to select version. This is Max Mandrix 64 bit. You need to select, click on next. This is a recommend RAM automatically assigned. I am increasing up to 3 above 3. Okay. After that, click next. You need to create a hard drive now. Next. Next. The next. This is my hard disk size, which I am giving at least. Uh, 25 gb okay and this is the location which is going to store it my installation hard disk so just now i have changed my location just click to next create and then go to settings go to systems we need to uncheck this enable efr box please you need to uncheck remember this box is compulsory we need to uncheck this box after unchecking the box go to this processor select 2 cpu or 1 cpu and need to check this box enable you should be check this box and here also both the box should be checked so you need to remember and see this both the box is checked or not after that <coughs> you need to assign your this video memory up to 1 to 10 mb or else you can have at least here also after that you need to go to storage click on empty click here choose a virtual hard drive now this is my os mandrix double click ok and go to network select bridge adapter click uh, go for settings check serial ports or usb port is checked on now ok just click ok and need to click start so here you can see this is my 
please enter us to start the driving or uh, with no options you can press f5 to swap the media so i'm going to press enter to continue the installation so after waiting some more times we came to this language we need to select which language you want to for the installation <laughs> select which language you required and click for this next use english language i'm using english language after that you click here small arrow so you can see install os x so after that you need to press enter to continue this installation to agree this license agreement upon click agree so here is a showing about this examining the available disk or we can customize so here is this very want to install nourish matrix 10.0.9 so what i have to do is just click on this like uh, image okay and then it will give us some link so we cannot install it so it is showing that uh, you cannot install os x on the same disk that contain this installation package so what you have to do is we need to uh, see for different uh, disk for installation so we need to click on utilities and we need to go for the disk utilities on the disk utility so, okay here click here and we need to <coughs> format this uh, this image after that we'll get a <coughs> get so gathering information so we can so uh, showing this we need to click on this uh, hard disk gb which are given Click on PDS, PDS and to give a partition name back and you can cloud name you can give any name and click to erase now. It will be format here. So this PDS this artist will be format. Confirm the formatting. Okay, now I click here cloud and then close this box. We need to close this one. Okay. After closing on uh, the left side of top, click this cloud and go for this install or you can have a customize. So go for the customizing. After customizing clean, we need to uncheck this uh, network install network device and then we need to click here and we need to uncheck this also uh, this uh, graphic enable does not support to virtual box after unchecking these two options just we need to what we have to do is click ok and then uh, we have to start the installation so go for this click to install now so now you can see initially Naresh Mavericks 10.0.9 So you can see there is only left for one minute now after waiting for long and long time for the installation process take almost so after restart <coughs> i have restarted this mine because it was hang up so i need to reboot it after reboot uh, i need to select a cloud option which i have given during the installation cloud name so after selecting it came here on the welcome screen you can see so we need to select this time zone uh just go to click here that belongs to india so i need to select in india or uh, from the map also you can select or from this uh, here also we can select just scroll down so finally i came to this naresh you can see just scroll down 
you have to wait till it's come three by it's can uh, you should go to settings you need to uncheck this sloppy and scroll down that means you need to remove this iso image which we are uh, installing with the iso image after unchecking this floppy just click to save ok and then show now so what happened means what happened means it will not install it will not ins install again so we need to select the time i'm going to click show scroll down to find uh, which so to press i india i'm going to select india and you need to select a keyboard language you can also find from show so you can see transfer information to this mac if you want to transfer how do you want to transfer this information from mac to time machine backup or start from windows pc or do want to transfer means uh, if you want to sign in with the apple id you can sign it uh, if you do not have icon means you can see the next option means to, uh, we need to check do not sign just check skip this one move to the next step we need to accept this agreement license agreement agree yeah agree and here we need to give computer name that i am giving full name cloud network account name should be cloud network the password i am using repeat the password it's the same and if you want to give any option you can give for required password to unlock the screen okay i am going to uncheck this box before i login time zone has been set i am going to uncheck this one also this, this icon is to login when we uh, login into the system so this icon is for this login purpose so if you want to register your mac you can register and check in Keep me up there now. Do not register now. Continue. Skip one. Set it. So this is my final <coughs> about the Mac. So you can see we have been uh, logging into the Mac OS. So this is you can see this icon being settings, and this is iBooks, iTunes, this is face camera, Snort. And let us check everything. I'm going to top up. So finally, you can see Navish uh, icon is there. This is a time zone. This is search bar, and this one is your notification is there, and this one is your window finder is there. Apple icon to check about this Mac. Let us check. We will show you some, and then if you want to have. software update you can update apple store system reference and so here you can find some more thing is an item it will show you quick if you want to shut down you can shut down restart so if you want to log out you can log out here but the finder is there and here window selection pop up so now i am going to show you how to make this Uh, Mac OS um, and Rich with the full screen. So to make a full screen, we need to first of all we need to open the Finder, then go to the extract folder, then we need to open this uh, boot dot list file, then we need to add this uh, string file and uh, resolution size. After that, we need to some do the command changes in the Windows file. Uh, let us do now first from Windows command. I will show you. Click start. And need to type here cmd, and then right click and run as administrator. Here after that, you need to go to C drive and programs file. You need to find virtual box where you have installed. Uh, type Oracle or O, and need to drag and drop here. Before dragging and drop here, I uh, forget to put the one command. Type cd and then drag this command here okay now press enter we came in, in, inside the uh, virtual box uh. so we need to add this two files into that command now i'm copying the first one command 
that is this one i'm going to copy first and then paste it here check okay now we'll move to the second copy it and paste this one okay so both <coughs> now this one has been complete windows now we'll move to the virtual now we'll go to windows or click on format to windows my computer click the name of cloud go to add library extra and click here right click and edit with text file open with text file we need to add here this one so i'm going to add i've been added this command two lines this one and this one are available. Now I am going to click control this to save this file. And close and we need to restart it. After that we can have access to this. So after doing this command, if you have any problem you can comment below to my video. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our video.